I woke up in the middle of the night from this noise coming from downstairs. It sounded like something was scratching the back door. But when I got downstairs, the noise had stopped. But when I looked at the window facing the woods, there were footprints in the snow. But my aunt and uncle were really strict, and they had this rule that we weren't allowed to go in their room when they were sleeping. So I made sure all the doors were locked, and I decided I would tell them in the morning. The next morning we woke up, and it was a really intense blizzard. Such heavy snowfall that we couldn't see the ground. So when I told my aunt and uncle about the footprints, they didn't believe me and told me it was probably a nightmare. The next day I had to leave, and I didn't go back and visit my cousins for a long time. But the next summer, my cousins really wanted me to come for their birthday party. Before visiting them, I looked up whether they had ever found the woman who had escaped from the hospital. And Google said that authorities were still looking for her, and it was a high priority case. When I got to their house, I was playing with my cousins. They were about to turn six years old. And one of them goes, let's go check if she's there. And my cousin runs to the window facing the woods. So I asked my other cousin who she was talking about. And she goes, oh, don't worry. That's just her imaginary friend. But I knew 